Good morning, everybody. <laughs> we're, we're really raw this morning. It is 10.41 a.m. on a Thursday, and I freaking knew this was gonna happen. I've avoided it up until this point, but I did wake up with a sore throat this morning, and I'm so devastated. I have so much going on right now, and it's I feel like that's how it always happens. And I feel like I even made a vlog similar to this a couple of months ago, where I was like, if you don't slow down, your body will force you to slow down, and like, look what happened. I literally was out with my friend last night. Drew's family was just here. Drew and I went to Disneyland yesterday. Like, we've just been go, go, go. And it's funny, because actually today, the day I'm filming this, um, my friend Sierra and I were supposed to be going to Disneyland, and then she texted me yesterday and I was like, I'm sick. And I was like, no problem. So we moved it to next week. And then I texted her today and I was like, good thing we canceled or like rescheduled for today because now I'm sick. So we'll see each other soon. It's just been like tough coordinating schedules, people getting sick, like we'll reschedule and it'll be fine. Drew and I just made some coffee this morning. We made some cookie butter lattes. Is yours good? Mm -hmm. It is yeah. good? I'm gonna try mine. That's way better hot. Mm. Mm, it is better hot. It's good. Probably. <laughs> but yeah, we had a great day. Went to Disneyland yesterday. We, did you get any new pins yesterday? No. Okay. But I did get some new ears. So they had some Christmas ears. So I got these and then I just got like another classic because. pair because. because I broke <laughs> the ones that I was wearing. I have a large head. That's um, a fun fact about me. Something really cute and girly and fun and fresh is that I have a massive head. Like I have to buy men's hats and sometimes even those are too small for me. So I was wearing a pair of ears that were kind of hurting my head. And so I was like, ooh, let me like stretch these out a little bit. And I was like, watch, I'm gonna break them. And Drew was like, be careful, don't break those. And then they snapped and they broke and there was just no way to repair it. So replaced those. And yeah, now we're waiting for our, um, bougie food delivery to get here. We actually, oh, this hurts holding. <laughs> it hurts holding my arm up. Can you one of those things where you like put it around you and like it's like a front face? My dad, when he makes his little Instagram vlogs, you can see in his sunglasses reflection that he's using the a selfie stick. <laughs> he's so tall. Yeah, he is tall. Every so often, if we're feeling fresh, we order Erewhon or go to Erewhon. But today, I mean, I'm I'm not gonna like get anyone sick. So we ordered breakfast burritos and breakfast sandwiches from Erewhon, and it's really expensive but really good. Actually, your breakfast sandwich was like eleven dollars, but my breakfast burrito was twenty dollars. Why? Because two people can eat it. Yeah, it is pretty big. So anyways, that's going on. And yeah, my one of my best friends, Laura, her birthday is this weekend. We were just out last night talking about it and shopping for it. She's doing like a country karaoke denim on denim birthday party. And like, I have to be better by then. And it's like two days away. So we'll see what happens. I'm gonna try to do my best to get as much work done today as possible. Good morning, good morning, hi because I know for a fact that tomorrow I will not be feeling very well. So I'm gonna try to do as much as I can today. Yeah, I'm busy, I'm talking to the camera. You stink. <laughs> You need a bath, girlfriend. Um, looking very cute. Um, this is my uniform these days. Here, I'll give you a little. <laughs> Here's what we've got going on. I got this cute, when my mom was here, I got this cute little like fleece thingy um, from Old Navy, adorable. Got my vintage sleep shirt on. This was what I walked the dog in this morning. <laughs> Drew just said it's called a poopy jacket because story time. One time we were going through a drive-thru and I was wearing a jacket like this that was pink. I used to wear it all the time, if you remember from my old vlogs. And the girl in the drive-thru was like, oh, do you have a poopy jacket on? Or is that one of those poopy jackets? And I go, sorry? I was like, do you mean poofy jacket? And she was like, I thought they were called poopy jackets. And I go, I think they're called poof, like poofy? I was so confused. And then she just goes, I don't know, sis. And then she just kept doing what she was doing. So from then on, Drew has called this my poopy jacket. Anyways, leggings. And then I actually recently got these little slippers from Amazon. I'm not about to pay for the UGG ones. I'm so sorry. And now they're kind of like my new dog walking shoes or maybe they'll be slippers i'm not sure so anyways that's what's new in this neck of the woods we're gonna eat our burritos watch some abbott elementary and then get back to some work unfortunately Ooh. so i got 
vegan or like tempeh bacon, eggs, cheese, peppers, onions, and hash browns, and then the red salsa, and it is <laughs> so good. It's definitely expensive, but it's really nice. All right, it's a little bit later. I've just got myself ready, and I'm gonna put on some deodorant for my sake, as well as Drew's. I'm literally just wearing like a version of pajamas because I'm filming like an outfits video where I'm essentially going to be changing outfits like every two seconds. So I think we're all set. We're ready. Let's go do some filming. I am progressively feeling worse, so time is of the essence here. We're gonna try to get this done as quickly as possible. I actually love filming these videos, these outfit videos. Um, and it does have like a brand partnership in it. That's why I need to do it today. It has like a deadline. And I kind of been slacking lately just with like people in town and stuff. So anyways, let's go film and have a good time and then maybe take a nap and take a bath. <laughs> All right, besties. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear it in my voice. It's a few hours later. I do think I might be crashing. Um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm really trying not to let this defeat me. I've had so much orange juice. I think I need to order like a bunch of wellness shots or something, like little tinctures. I don't think that actually works. I think all you can really do is ride it out. But anyways, maybe I'll try to take a nap. I just can feel it coming. And like, I usually don't get that sick. Like I would say I get sick a couple times a year pre-pandemic, but I'm sure my immune system after not being sick for literally two years, like I'm sure my immune system is just like doing her best, <laughs> just readjusting and all of that. But I am boosted and I did get my flu shot as well. So hopefully, you know, that will be great protection for me. But yeah, I think I'm gonna change into my cozies, maybe even like take a shower or a bath, take a little bit of a nap, and then maybe we'll catch up later when I'm feeling better, hopefully, fingers crossed. <laughs> well, everyone ignore my hair, it'll make sense in a second but um i don't know how i did it but i did it i pulled this out of my ass and i somehow healed myself in two days i don't know if it was maybe just allergies because drew said he also got a sore throat but it never progressed beyond that and i'm like a little bit sniffly but like y'all when i get a cold it's like i get a cold i'm like down for the count and today i'm like a tiny bit sniffly, but I think it might actually have just been allergies. I don't know. Anyways, I didn't feel great yesterday, but today, fine. So I've done it. I've healed myself. I'm so excited and I'm getting ready right now. I need to like do the finishing touches on my hair and whatnot. But my friend Laura is having her birthday party tonight and we're going to a karaoke bar. We're doing dinner first and then going to a karaoke bar. If you've watched my vlogs for a really long time, then you'll know that karaoke is like our thing. We've done it for years. It's just like always been our thing. So what better than to like celebrate it with a group of people. So that'll be really fun. And actually there's a theme because we love a theme. So the theme for tonight for her birthday is god denim i'm 35. we came up with that oh hey <laughs> we came up with that after a few glasses of wine the other night so it's basically like um denim on denim encouraged so i'm gonna get changed into my outfit drew oh um, he doesn't have his denim jacket on but he'll wear that in a little bit so we have hello <laughs> Hi. Are you just wanting to be on camera? It dribbled. Oh. Okay. okay. So what I have for tonight is I actually I was gonna wear this shirt, which is iconic. No, no, right? no I think I'm gonna do something else. This shirt right here is so amazing and I love it, but I don't know if it fits the vibe because it's like that with like some flares and some converse would be cute. It says 90s fucking country, by the way. But instead I thought maybe I would just do like a white halter top underneath. Just keep it simple. The denim on denim is really the star. So, okay, let me get dressed and we'll uh, we'll see what we're gonna do. Also, we have to go to Laura's before this because she was gonna borrow some of my cowboy boots. So all of my cowboy boots are at her place. So I gotta pick those up. But anyways, let's get dressed and then we'll assess. All right, update here is what we have for the look for tonight i've got my cute little halter top on my denim jacket is from the, i think the rose bowl maybe like a few years ago these jeans are secondhand but i think they're from american eagle and then i put on this belt because it's like sort of like western ish but i don't think it's the vibe and drew said he doesn't love it either so i'm gonna take this off and then i'm gonna wear either some brown or some white cowboy boots with this i have both so we'll see when we get there but i'll just throw on my little slides when we get in the uber we're gonna head to her house i'm gonna do my lipstick up put on my earrings kind of try to like zhuzh my hair up a bit do some volume and then we're gonna hit the road so let's party gotta put in my bump it drew says okay let's go <laughs> 
All right, just kidding. I have like an extra mm, 10 minutes because there's been a delay, but I'm finishing up getting ready now. So I thought I would show you a couple of the things that I'm using. I'm using, what are they called again? Prism lashes by lilac street they're like the kind of little wispy ones that you put underneath so i literally have the glue on them right now oh and you just do that it should be that easy but i think i waited too long and my glue dried and then i also wanted to try this um hair tool thingy that i saw on tiktok forever ago i bought this when we still lived in arizona like that's how long i've had it and i've been meaning to try it and i just never have so since i have a few extra minutes might as well Making a mess as per usual. Yeah. Would it be a video from me without a mess? No, it wouldn't. It's called the Volum Rudy. Lil has something to say about it clearly. And it's like a hair volumizing tool. So you essentially create like texture in your hair and then it gives you more volume. There's like a ton of stuff that comes in the box. I'm not doing like a full review, but I really want to try it out. It was kind of expensive. I don't know if it's as expensive anymore because I don't know if it's like trending as much on TikTok, but it was real popular on TikTok like over the summer. And I saw Christy makeup by Christy. I'm trying to think of her youtube name i'll link her video down below but um i saw a review that she did on it and i was like yeah i want that it's like this tool that has look at that texture so weird so you basically like turn on your thing plug in and hold start button for three to five seconds to turn on okay start at low heat setting section your dry hair and be sure to clamp for only about one second and then release and then you can raise your temperature by five degree increments until you find your ideal temperature it says do not squeeze it together and hold it for longer than one second so it's literally you're supposed to go like this and like that's it let that heat up while i do this me and these lashes sometimes we get along sometimes we don't but like i have some time so why not oh see I will say though, the lash serum that I've been using has been doing its thing. Like my lashes have grown so much. I've been using this Grande Lash MD lash serum. And it works really well. I've had it for about three months now. And then I also bought the Ordinary as a backup for when that one runs out. Oh no. I don't know if these are gonna work. <laughs> I don't know if these are gonna work out. This is gonna be one of those ADHD things where I actually run out of time, probably. Okay, you know what? Scratch that. We're actually, <laughs> we're scrapping the lashes. Um, I just don't have time. I get way too ambitious with my time. Okay, in case you were wondering, those are the ones I still use. Usually with this glue, this Lashify glue, I like put it right here on the base of my lashes, but I didn't do that because I already have mascara on. So like, that's my bad. Anyways, we'll go back to it. Okay, so what I think you're supposed to do is like take a section of hair and then you're gonna do like the section underneath it. I might even do like, another one because my hair is kind of fine so i'll do like this and you literally clamp it for one second like this okay definitely need to turn it up and it basically crimps up your hair a little bit and then it gives it more volume is it doing anything oh maybe it is okay let me do it like right up here at the root mm -mm. Is it doing anything? Do I need to have it on a higher temperature? Ooh. It's doing something now. Ooh. Wait. Okay, the lighting's really bad in here, but look at that. Wait, that's good. Can you see that? That actually did make a difference. Okay, let me do the other side. I have like two minutes to get ready. What am I doing? Why do I do this? Here we go. One second. One. One one yeah it's doing something i could sit here all night and do this to like make my hair this tall but i really do have to go but look how much of a difference that just made that is so good that's exactly what i was looking for i wanted big hair okay i mean pretty good especially if you have like finer hair like me that's my neighbor's child all right gonna put on my perfume it is well it's my neighbor's child don't worry they scream all the time all right, just called the Uber. I'm gonna throw my jacket on and some slides because we're going to get my proper shoes here in just a little bit. Gonna chug some water and then hit the road. Let's do it. Definitely switching to my phone. We'll talk later. <laughs>
back on top in June.